something and we also try to join us and to help me one thing i want to tell you that very big gathering is here to maintain it is very hard difficult so the devotees though i have not paid and not registered their names please they should they must come forward and pay registration fee otherwise how they can maintain so my request is to pay the registration fee and then when chait nita one day he was in advait bhavan they are nitananda prabhu ke and at once chaitanya mahaprabhu bhakti nimai became sarvabhut in four hands shankh chakra gada padma and here dhanush and in one hand hand ban arrow and in one hand bansi fourth narayan and then ram and then krishna after some time oh nityananda prabhu sahab chaturbhuj ro shankh chakra gada padma and after that of oh, devi imurli dharsham sundar shi sha and he fell flat on the lotus feet of chaitanya, chaitanya mahaprabhu so so many sweet past times he did after that vyas puja how he did oh yo om agyan chiranjasya yananjalashalakaya chakshu mitam jena tasmay shri gurave namaha vanchakalpaturubhischa riba sindhu vevcha patitanam pavnebhyo vaishnavebhyo namanama Shukadev is very mercifully ordered me to relate the past time of Vyasa Puja as Shri Vardhan Das Thakur relates in Sri Chaitanya Bhagavat <coughs> is a very wonderful and sweet past time in that one day when Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was with uh, Lord Nitananda and many devotees were all gathered around and Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu he had asked Lord Nitananda all oh, the time has come like on Guru Purnim to worship Vyas day we should perform Vyas puja and he ordered Lord Nitananda that you should uh, see to this that you should head it up and he said to uh, uh, Lord Nitananda where would you like to have this and lord jananda looked every around and he saw shiva's pandit was sitting next to him took his hand and raised it in the air and said i will perform vyas puja at this brahman's house and so they lord the uh, chitana mahaprabhu he asked um shiva's pandit oh you can do, do this you have everything that is in this and uh, shiva's pandit said yes we have all paraphernalia for puja only i will have to obtain the book which explains how to perform the uh, properly and we were very fortunate this year when we were with shri gurudev for his yas puja celebration in malaysia where the puja went on properly there with all the different arrangements made and and everything was done just according to the proper vaishnav stand, stand, standard there So Shri Vas Pandit he acquired the book how to perform the puja and they all went then the next day to Shri Vas Pandit's house and all the arrangements were made all the for the worship of Vyasa day and when it came time for Lord Nitananda to worship uh Shri Vyasa day they had given him a garland and Shri Vas Pandit uh told to Lord Nitananda Well, you should put this garland. You should offer it to Vyas Vyasdev. 
So Lord Nityananda, he took the garland, but instead of going up to the picture of Srila Vyasadeva, he held it in his hand and he was looking all around and just started to mumble. Oh, looking all around and saying, mumbling sounds. And he just went on like this. And Sri Vaspana said, you should offer the garland to Vyasadeva. And Lord Nityananda just continued holding the garland and looking around and making mumbling sounds. And then uh, Sri Vaspandit turned to the Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and said, Oh, it seems that today your Sripad does not want to worship Vyasadeva. And so Mahaprabhu turned to him and said, uh, oh, Nityananda, put the garland on, the, give the offer the garland to Srila Vyasadeva. And then Lord Nityananda was very pleased. And he turned to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and put the garland directly on him. <laughs> To show that he is the original source of, of Shiva Vyasadeva and all the incarnations as Avatari. So the uh, then the Vyasa Puja celebration was actually perfect at that point. And Chitana Mahaprabhu ordered then it was time for Kirtan. And all the devotees had a big uh, kir kir Kirtan celebrating Vyasa Puja on that day. <laughs> Began Sankirtan. In the house of Srivas Pandit, he used to close the door and in the side, Advaita Chat, Nityananda Prabhu, Srivasa Chat, so many Sanjay Mukunda Basu, Ghoshri, and all others used to sit there and dance and sing whole light. Now it went on as a daily routine. In the meantime, Muslim Kaji, the governor of that place, sent others his his so police Go and stop that kirtan. Otherwise, I will uh, take the house of Srivas Pandit and I will fell it to Ganges. <laughs> and then the policemen went there and they were doing a sankirtan. And then it Oh. He told them strictly that you should stop your kirtan. Otherwise, Kaji will come and punish you. Then, returned back, Srivas Pandit and others became very nervous. What to do? Mahaprabhu told, Oh, don't be worried. Go on doing. I will see that card. When the policeman went to Kaji, then he was telling only Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Hare what became? Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. And oh, where is where your Musta can be at? Oh, oh. By Hare Krishna, it, it was one. And uh, Hare Krishna. Why you are telling? Hare Krishna. What he was telling? Questioning? Oh, Hare Krishna. Nothing else. <laughs> then he became very wondered. And again he came himself. And he broke the Mridang of Srivast Pandit. And Mm. Stop the kirtan. When Chaitanya Mahaprabhu heard in the night, he called all his bucks and he told that I will see that Shyam Kaji, how he stops our kirtan. So he took some, some lakhs and thousands of persons having thoughts with. Torch. 
but not torch actually like that. Uh, in bottle, some Kiroshan oil is given and very flame coming. So in the night, after evening, in a group, thousands and thousands of devotees doing kirtan so many mridans and he proceeded. And in the way, uh, did kirtan and in the end he went to Kaji house. Kaji closed his door. And Mahaprabhu Bhaks began to root uh, rooted the garden of Chand Kaji Samadhi. Where is Kaji Samadhi? Come on, we will see. Like Hanuman, Murari Gupta and others began to jump here and here. <laughs> After that, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu sent a messenger to Chand Kaji. Oh, in relation to village, he is our mama. Maternal uncle. I have come to meet him and why he is hiding himself. He should come. And then he came as a fearful. Mahaprabhu told that you are my mama. Why you are closing door and he is hiding yourself? He told me last night I saw that after when I returned back from breaking Mardanga, in the night I saw a lion, half lion, half man, fall. He appeared and he began to. If you, I am warning you. From today, you should not stop my kirtan. <laughs> and if you are not hearing, then I. And then he disappeared. He saw him, Mahaprabhu. Oh, the scratch was there. So I am I'm now promising that myself or in my bank dynasty. dynasty, anyone will not stop kirtan. You can do kirtan as you like, everywhere, here, there, in the house, out there. And then, ah, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked, one question I want to ask you. We worship cows like mother. Cow is milk like mother to all. No difference between Hindu, Muslim, Christian, Isai, anyone. So why you kill your mother? Then he told that in our Quran it has not been written. So from today I am giving a strict order anyone cannot kill cows in his kingdom. And thus Chaitanya Mahaprabhu happily returned to his house. Now, one day, Mahaprabhu closing the door with his devotees no. while doing Krishna. In the meantime, Anya Smar, he took the stencil of Durga Puja, Kali Puja, reddish flower, Alcohol eh? uh, and other things, uh, meat also, and he kept on the door of Srivasa Church. His name was Gopal Chapal. Next day in the morning, Srivas came out of the room and he saw all oh, these things on our species. Then he called the Never heard most important person. Oh, for me, I, you know that you see, I daily worship Kali, and that is why this sauce. Then they began to talk. Oh, hi, hi. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. 
who has done this? Huh? And they began to, to, to fight on that person. And this Gopal Chopal, after two days he became uh, leprosy and all, every hair, all uh, insects were. After that, one day he was closing the door and doing kirtan. In the meantime, a Brahman wanted to came, come there in the house and join kirtan. But door was not open. So he calls, Oh, Nimai Pandit, you will have to give up your father, your mother and wife and everything and you will be renounced order. Mahaprabhu became very happy and that is why he very soon took sannyas and went to Puri. After that, before that, how he uh, liberated Jagai Madhai as from Maharaj Vinod. Om Ajnanatmirandasya Gananjana Shalakaya Jakshu Unmilitam Jena Tasma Shri Guru Vena Maha Vanchakalpaturubhista Kripasana Bevacha Patitanam Bhavanebhyo Vaishnavebhyo Namon Maha Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadana Shiva Sadi Govaka Vinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare Hare so I offer my most respectful basis on the lotus feet of my Diksha Guru, Nitalila Vishnu Vishnu Padas Dutra Sata Shishna Shilagor Gavinagal Samaraj. Also, the most respectful basis on the lotus feet of my Sanyasa Shiksha Guru, Om Vishnu Padas Dutra Sata Shishma Shilabhakti Dhanta Narayangal Samaraj. And my most respectful basis is on the lotus feet of my Param Guru Devs, Nitalila Vishnu Vishnu Padas Dutra Sata Shishma Shila. Bhakti Dhanta Swami Shri Prabhupada and Nitali Lab Vishnu Vishnu Padasa Dura Sutta Shishma Shri Bhakti Pagyan Keshava Samaraj all Vaishnav Sanyasis, Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis. So, Vishnamba has now started his Sankirtan movement and he's in his place on a raised diet and seated in front of him, or kneeling down in front of him, are Srila Haridas Thakur and Sri Nityananda Prabhu. So, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he addresses Haridas Thakur and Lord Nityananda. He says, Oh Nityananda, Oh Haridas, I want you to go from door to door and I want you to beg. And what is it that he wanted, wanted them to beg? Bolo Krishna, Vajra Krishna, Koro Krishna Shiksha. He said, I want you to beg this from the people. That you go to them and you plead with them. That please, you chant the names of Krishna. That please, you worship Krishna. And you follow the instructions of Krishna. After giving them these instructions, then Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he said, and you come back every day and you report back to me what has happened. Very dutifully, Lord Nityananda Prabhu and Srila Haridas Thakur, they went and they were knocking door to door. One um, householder would answer, answer the door and Lord Nityananda would beg, Oh please, chant Krishna's name. Please, worship Krishna. Please follow Krishna's instructions. And the householder being very pious, hearing these instructions coming from the word mouths of Lord Nityananda, who said, yes, I will do, I will do. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. And then they will go to the next house. Shri Hari Das Thakur, his turn. Oh please, chant the name of Krishna. Worship Krishna and follow his instructions. You fool, get out of my house. I will crack your head. I think you're using this as a disguise and you want to come in um, steal in my house. Out! Out! And then they would go in this way door to door. Some people accepting, some people rejecting, 
some people in racing, some people kicking, <laughs> better than Ronaldo. And in this way, you're going through the streets of Navadui. So then, um, one day, as Lord Nityananda and Shilohari Das Thakur were going down, they saw two drunken men in a very, very deep drunken stupor. Very, very big, burly. And then... <laughs> very, very drunken. And beating one another. And then Lord Nityananda, he looked. And great compassion, pity came in his heart. And he was thinking, I've never seen two people in such a degraded state. Then he looked towards the townspeople, and one of them he asked, who are these two people? Who are they? And then he explained that these two are Jagai and Madai. That previously, they have come from a very high class Brahmin family. They're known as Jagadananda and Madhavananda. But due to very bad association, look at the result. So here, we're understanding what is the quality of Sangha. That somebody may be on the good path, but just by some bad association, their whole life can be ruined. And by good association, their whole life can be glorified. Lord Nityananda, seeing this, he was thinking, that these two people, they're so fallen. And that if I'm really a servant of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu of Nimai, and I would really deserve the name Nichananda if I can help to deliver these two. And my Nimai will then be celebrated as Patit Bhavan. So he made up his mind that these two will be delivered. Then with Srila Haridas Thakur, he said, Haridas, let's go. Let's go and save these two. And Haridas was looking, said, I'm right behind you. And he let him go. And he was just going a little bit slow, a little bit slow. Huh? Then Lord Nityananda, he went. And then he saw them. He said, oh my brothers, oh bye. Please chant the name of Krishna. Bolo Krishna. Bajo Krishna, Koro Krishna now. At that time, they opened their eyes from their drunken stupor and they looked at him. But when they saw him, they saw three Nityanandas. They said, which one is the real one? And then they said, oh, get out of here. And then they started to chase them. Lord Nityananda, he was very fast. Immediately, he sped down the, the village lanes. But Srila Haridas Thakur was quite old. And Srila Haridas Thakur was struggling a bit. And as Lord Nityananda was running, he was laughing. And he was looking back at Haridas Thakur. And he was, <coughs> he said, Oh, Nityananda, what a fine mess you've got us into. Oh, Lord Nityananda believed he said, Oh, just see, what a fine mess you've got us into. And then, no, Lord Nityananda said, No. This is the work of your Lord. You see what he has done to us? He gives such an order. And if we don't follow, then we're finished. And if we follow, look at the result. <laughs> and then Haridas Tako just barely made it away. Then they went to report to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And reporting, they explained that yesterday, we came across two personalities. Previously, they were known as Jagananda and Madhavananda. But now, due to bad association, they're known as Jagai and Madai. There's no sinful activity that they have not performed. They steal. They, oh, unmentionable things they do. Then, look, um, in the side, Shilaharidas Thakur, he was speaking to Advaita Acharya. He said, you see, you see what your Nityananda is doing? Sometimes, this Nityananda, when we go door to door, then he goes, and then he climbs on top of a bull, 
and then he's riding the bull and he gets into the Vesh, the mood of Lord Shiva uh, and he's going, oh Nandi, Nandi, Nandi and he's going here and there. Sometimes we're going down the bank of the Ganges and the Ganges is flowing very sweetly. Crocodiles, very dangerous. And he jumps into the Ganges and he starts to swim after the crocodiles to wrestle with them. The crocodiles become so astonished, they turn and they swim away. A little extra. <laughs> and sometimes he goes to the house of a milkman. And when his daughter answers, then he goes, oh, will you marry me? <laughs> He's a madman. And what did he do yesterday? He's crazy. He approached two drunks, Jagai and Madai. And he thinks that they will get Krishna Prem. He says that they'll get Krishna Prem. Advaita Chari said, smiling, you know, very soon. There won't be two drunken people, but there'll be three drunken, drink, drunken people dancing in love of God. Four, four dancing in love of God. Satinandan Gora Hari Ki, Srinitananda Prabhu Ki. So, in this way... Who are these two Brahmins? Bring, bring them to me, and I will cut them into many, many pieces. Oh Lord, oh Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you've come to deliver the fallen conditioned souls. You know, your name will be glorified as Patit Pavan. So please, you give me chance. Let, us, let me go and let me try on your behalf. Oh Nitinanda, your glories are so unlimited. Because you have desired to deliver them, I know that very soon Jagai Madai will be delivered from the pit of ignorance and they will achieve Krishna Pram. Nityananda Prabhu Ki! Next day, Lord Nityananda and Sri Haridas Thakur, they, all, they started to wander, meander down the banks of the Ganges. And again, they saw the two drunken men, Jagai and Madai. <laughs> Lord Nityananda, seeing them, his heart melting, he started to approach. Baharidas held him. Are you sure you want to do this? <laughs> but Lord Nityananda, he went, he said, Oh my brothers, oh my, please chant the holy names of Krishna. Say about those names. Please. <laughs> this is for your well-being, my brother. You'll be happy. You won't suffer anymore. It will give you a nun. So much bliss. As Lord Nityananda was approaching. Then he got hit by a clay pot by Madai. And then blood started to ooze. Madai was going to hit him again. But Jagai held it back. Haridas was nowhere to be seen. <laughs> he was far away. <laughs> then news. News got to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu that Lord Nityananda had been hit. Then Nimai.
they will be like Jagais and Madais. <laughs> worse than Jagais and Madais. Much worse. So please, you be merciful to them and you give them to me. Jagai has saved my Nitinanda Prabhu. Nitinanda Prabhu is like my life and soul. Nitinanda Prabhu is my second body. Oh Jagai, by saving Nitinanda Prabhu, you have purchased me. Therefore, I bestow upon you all perfection and Krishna Prem. My Lord, and what about me? Will you not forgive me? Will you not give me your mercy? What can I do to get your mercy? How can I obtain your mercy? Your, your sin is much worse than any other demon in history. You sin together, it's true. When, he would, when you would drink, he would open the bottle. When you would burn the house, he would give you the matches. You have done unlimited sin. You are worse than any demon. Because in previous yugas, many, many demons tried to kill me by piercing my body with arrows. But Madai, your sin is much worse than any sin of any demon previously. Because you have dared to strike the body of my dear Nityananda Prabhu. Therefore, you can never be forgiven and for millions and millions of years, you will rot in Kumbi Paka hell. <laughs> Lord! <laughs> but Lord, you have given mercy to everyone, to Haranyakashipu, to Ravana, to Kumbhakarna. Can you not give some mercy to me? Is there any way, any way that I can get your mercy? Is there some path? <coughs> There is only one way that you may be forgiven and saved from Kumbhipaka. <laughs> that is, if you beg the mercy of Sri Nityananda Prabhu. Nityananda Prabhu is so very kind and merciful. If he forgives you, then I will also forgive you. Oh Nitai! Oh Nitai! Please give me your mercy! Please give me your mercy! Please forgive me! <laughs> Jagai and Madai are no more to be regarded as sinful persons. From this day, my potency personally enters into their bodies and they shall become the topmost devotees. Previously, if anyone saw Jagai, they would go to the Ganga and take bath. But I declare from this day, the darshan of Jagai Madai will be superior to taking bath in the Ganga. Jagai Madai will become the topmost devotees and anyone who contacts them, their lives will be perfect. Therefore, all the Vaishnavas, we should take Jagai Madai, but on one condition. I take all your sins. I personally take them with me, but on one condition. You must promise never to perform sinful activity ever again. You give your word, you promise. Jagai Madai Boli, Aranahi We promise. Okay. Then everyone do kirtan. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ramo, Hare Ramo, Ramo Ramo, Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Today we are giving rest to her.
की कथा एंड ऑल्सो यू आर सो मच टायर्ड इन नगर संकीर्तन तुम्हारो वेरी पैटिक संदास लीला और चेतन महाप्रभु एंड शांति को दे आर मीटिंग रघुनाथ दास को स्वामी एंड गिविंग हिज समीशिंग्स एंड देन ही वेंट टू जगन्नाथ पुरी एंड व्हाट वी कैम लेटर ऑन वी विल डिस्कॉल फ्रॉम दिस गौ प्रमाणे हरे कृष्णा फॉर द काइंड अटेंशन ऑफ डिवोटीज एज ही हैव अनाउंस्ड टुमारो विल बी हरि नाम एंड दीक्षा इनिशिएशन 8:30 एएम for male devotee have to be shaven clean head and have been keeping sikhar and who will they be offering to guru they don't cut any fruits fruits can be solid and some flowers and some donation looks we will bring and initiation will be other place of there is a big hall for the son hall will be their initiation because due to the bhajan pool is too small we could not fit so many devotees so only two minutes away from here there is a big hall this is only about there and they can register their name sipad vishnu maharaj now they will sit in prasad hall and register their name over there so whoever want initiation they must be certified by any local devotee from which country you are taking initiation you must be certified from that country or any our senior guest now who knows you from long time so for male clean shave head and clean cloth have to bring some fruits and some flowers and some donation hari krishna now vishnu bhagwan prabhu want to announce something vishnu <laughs> bhagwan Hare Krishna, begging the patience of Shri Gurudev and all of the assembled Vaishnavas, I've been asked to make this um, search for three people. Actually, although the announcement is to everyone, there's only eight of these in the world, and there's only three in Europe. And this is um, one of the, the the highest processes for uh, putting on canvas a painting. The painting was done by Manjari Devi Dasi under the direct spiritual direction of Shila Gurudev and the artistic direction of Shamarani Devi. Um, it is this painting is also found in the Gopi Gita. After three days distributing the book, I realized people think this is a reprint of the Venu Gita. No, this is Gopi Gita. Also, it's not um, Gita Govinda. and it's definitely not the bhagavad gita <laughs> so um, if you can't get one of the three that are available of these you can at least get the gopi gita and uh, like that yes in the, in the back of the, in the back of the book shila gurudev is can, uh, singing the verses with nice background music and there's also two lectures like that like that a small print but the painting here if you would please approach shamrani didi this is uh, a very uh, in the just like in the in our body there are life airs uh, life that keep us alive the shimar bhagavatam also is considered to have five life airs and this is one of the five this moment the song of separation of the gopis so um, if anyone is interested to help the project in Navadweep all the proceeds that are donated towards this uh, reproduction of the painting will go towards that i heard a rumor that the last one that went somewhere else in the world for a thousand euros or something like that but if you have the means and you want to be one of the three please approach shimati shamarani devi hare krishna thank you uh, and, and, and if, if there's more than three you will have to have an auction How many raise your hands of any interest in this to see? Yeah. 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 There's one one person here, two people here, and one from Hawaii maybe. Maybe there are three and there's four. So Shamarani Didi, she's famous, you know. She is please you approach her and if you want to make all there's more than three people perhaps we can. Hare Krishna, I want to go with you, sir. Please.